All new at six, neighbors in one part of Delaware County say they're just tired of cars speeding past their homes. One woman says she is constantly on edge waiting for the next accident to happen right at her front porch on Meeting House Road in Upper Chichester Township. She asked us to try to get some answers from her township. NBC 10's Tim Furlong got some. Unchecked speeding. Lola says speed. That's the sole reason this curve on Meeting House Road in Upper Chichester is so dangerous. This right here, right here, all the time. Whether it's late nighters coming out of the bar down the road or folks just speeding, drivers' mistakes end up as her problem. So we've had four cars totaled in less than 10 years parked. The last incident was in early February. He hit the house, he hit the three cars that were parked here. He hit the porch. Lola says this has been going on for decades. People here have been hit and seriously injured by cars. Shrubs have been run over. Debris has smashed neighbors' windows. I put all these rocks here. And even the rocks they put near the road haven't really added much protection. We've had to replace at least seven or eight mailboxes because of speeding, unchecked speeding. She started to have her driveway enlarged so her family could park closer to her house, and that led to a permit dispute with the township. She and her neighbors just want this figured out. One part of the problem seems to be the speed limit at the Delaware line at the top of the hill. It's 35 miles per hour, and it's 25 on the PA side, although to my eye, it seems most drivers seem to disregard both of those numbers. The Upper Chichester Township Manager tells me another big part of the problem is that Pennsylvania remains the only state in America, the only state where local police aren't allowed to use radar devices to catch speeding drivers. In Pennsylvania, as of right now, the law says only state troopers can use radar. The township manager didn't talk to me on camera, but he says he knows this road has had problems, and he says another speed limit sign recently went up, and an engineer has now put up a system to study how many cars go through here and how fast they're going. See, this one I mean, all the time. In other parts of Upper Chichester, there are lots of roads with lots of signs and flashing lights and speed humps, but a township lawyer tells me they can't legally just throw up guardrails or other measures on any road without first studying the best, safest options. The township promises me they are working on this spot, but in the in the meantime, Lola just keeps watching cars zoom, zoom, zoom past her house, which is surely better than having them smash into it. No one does 25, ever. In Upper Chichester Township, Tim Furlong, NBC 10 News.